So glad that you guys can join us this morning. All right, we're gonna make ice cream today. So exciting. Let's start with our good morning song, okay? Hands in the head. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. We're all in our places with sunshiny faces. And this is the way we start our new day. Mwah, 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 mwah. Can we do hugs? Let's do hugs. Put your hands in your head. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. We're all in our places with sunshiny faces. And this is the way. We start our new day. Hug, 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 hug. Yay, big hugs for all of you. Okay, friends, today we're going to make ice cream, okay? Megan is gonna show us how. I've never made ice cream before, so this is very exciting for me too. Hi, friends. Hope everyone's doing well. We're gonna make ice cream. This is a very old recipe. I used to make this when I went to summer camp with all of my friends. So if you have any questions, let me know, but we'll send it out again in an email so you can make it at home with mommy and daddy. Um, does anyone remember what holiday we're celebrating today? That's right, Shavuot. And on Shavuot, we eat a lot of things made from dairy. So we eat blintzes, we eat cheesecake, a lot of chocolate. So today we're gonna make our very own ice cream and maybe if we're all good, we can eat it before lunch. So first what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your small bag, your quart size bag, and inside of this bag, you're gonna pour your one cup of milk. I already measured mine out. I'm using regular milk. You could probably use almond milk or oat milk or whatever you have at your house. I've never tried it with that, but I assume it will work just the same. You're also gonna add in your one tablespoon of sugar. So sugar is good, it gives us a lot of energy. So do a helping tablespoon of sugar. And then last thing you're gonna put in this bag is your Vanilla. This gives it the yummy flavor of vanilla ice cream. The recipe calls for half a taste, half a teaspoon, but I like to add in just a little bit more for some extra flavoring. So measure it really carefully. Mommy and daddy can help you. You need help. Perfect. And the next thing you're going to do is you're going to take this bag and you're going to close it really carefully and try to get out some of the air. Awesome. We'll give everyone a minute. This is what it looks like so far. Looks like liquidy ice cream. So while you guys all do that, I'm gonna get some ice. You're gonna take your big bag, your gallon size bag, and you're gonna fill it over halfway full of ice cubes. Okay, so you guys all finished that. I'm gonna go get some ice. Okay, let's see how everyone's bags look. Can you show me your bag with your milk and your sugar in it? It looks great. And now let's see those ice bags. So a big bag filled over halfway, full of ice. And the secret What's gonna make it ice cream is we have to add some salt to the ice. I'm using Morton's iodized salt. It help, the salt will help the ice get super, super cold. So when you're ready to start shaking, you're gonna take your salt, just like this, and you're gonna pour it in the bag. And the next thing, before we close it, so we're gonna take our milk and our sugar and our vanilla. We're gonna drop it right in the big bag. And then we're gonna close it. Close it really, really tight. Let out some of the extra air. So then nothing comes out. Now this is the fun part, but also a little tricky. The bag is gonna get really cold. Really, really cold, because there's a lot of ice in it. So I suggest either putting on some gloves, 
You can use a kitchen towel. That's what I'm gonna use, just like this. And this is the super fun part. You're gonna take the bag and you're gonna shake it. You're gonna shake it for a long time. This is what's gonna help get the ice cream. Make sure your milk is covered in ice and you're just gonna stay here. And we're gonna shake the bags for a long, long time until we'll check it in a little bit to see if there's any ice cream inside. Does anyone have any questions or anything? I think while we are all shaking our bags, Angelica, Miss Angelica, she's gonna read us a story and sing a song with us, but I want everyone to keep shaking their bags. And when Angelica is done, we're gonna come back and we're gonna check and hopefully there's gonna be some really yummy ice cream inside. Okay? All right, everyone start shaking. Hey friends. Do you have your baggie? I have my baggie too. Mine is probably going to take a little longer because I'm not going to be able to shake it while I read to you guys. That's okay. Can't wait to see your ice cream. Like Megan said, you know, we're making ice cream because it's Shavuot and um, we eat a lot of dairy during this holiday. So I have a book. I know you guys talked about the Ten Commandments with Debbie yesterday, and we were talking about the rules that some of you guys have at home. So I have this book. It's called Ten Good Rules. Let's read. When the Jewish people left Egypt, Moses led them to a mountain in the desert. Moses climbed the mountain and talked to God. God gave Moses 10 good rules for the people to follow so they could live happily together. Number one, let's see. I am the one and only God. See what rule number two says. Do not pray to other gods. Oh, do you see what the guy, the little kid's holding? Do you see what he's holding? What is that? Do you remember? Debbie had one yesterday. That's right, it's the Torah. Rule number three, do not say bad words. Do we say bad words? No, we don't, right? Not nice. Rule number four, let's see. Celebrate Shabbat. We love Shabbat. What number is this? Number five. Love your mother and father. We love our mommies and daddies, our emas and our abbas. We do. Number six. Do not hurt anyone. Oh. That friend looks a little sad. We don't hurt anyone, right? No. Number seven. Married people should love each other. Number eight. Do not take anything without asking. She's taking her toy. That's not nice. How should we ask? Do we ask for a turn? Yes. And we wait our turn. Number nine. Do not tell lies.
Number 10, last one. Be happy with what you have. Moses told the people the 10 good rules. They listened and they promised to follow them. Those 10 good rules are just as important for us today. Do you like that book? I like that book. Those are some good rules to follow. What's a good rule to have in the classroom? Does anyone know what's a good rule that we can have in the classroom? Don't hit each other. Don't hit each other. That's right. We keep our hands to our own body. That's a good rule to have in the classroom. How's the shaking coming along? Let's see. I'm going to shake mine a little bit, too. Yeah, let's check on some of people's ice creams. I'm going to open mine up and see what it looks like inside. Be very careful. Ooh, mine does feel like ice cream. I could probably shake it a little bit more, but do you think we should taste test it? I think we should. Let me go get, you can go get a spoon because we can't use our fingers for ice cream. Too cold. So grab a spoon and with the help of mommy and daddy, you can carefully open the bag. See, you can see mine looks like ice cream inside. It's not liquidy anymore. It's more like ice cream. You're gonna take a little spoonful. Ooh, very cold. Um, it tastes like vanilla ice cream. I feel like that would be really good with some chocolate sauce on top. Really yummy. Let's see everyone else's ice creams. Can you hold them up? Let's see. Awesome. So exciting. Well, some of you can still keep shaking. I have one more story I want to read to you guys. Does anyone know this book? There was an old lady who swallowed a fly. Let's see. There was an old lady who swallowed a fly. I don't know why she swallowed a fly. She won't say why. Let's see. There was an old lady who swallowed a spider that wriggled and jiggled and tickled inside her. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. I don't know why she swallowed the fly. You won't say why. There was an old lady who swallowed a bird. How absurd to swallow a bird. She swallowed the bird to catch the spider. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. I don't know why she swallowed that fly. She won't say why. There was an old lady who swallowed a cat. Imagine that. She swallowed a cat. She swallowed the cat to catch the bird. She swallowed the bird to catch the spider. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. I don't know why she swallowed that fly. She won't say why. I wonder if her tummy hurts. Everything that she swallowed. There was an old lady who swallowed a dog. What? She swallowed a dog. What a hug to swallow a dog. She swallowed the dog to catch the cat. She swallowed the cat to catch the bird. She swallowed the bird to catch the spider. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. I don't know why she swallowed the fly. She won't say why.
There was an old lady who swallowed a goat. Just opened her throat and swallowed a goat. She swallowed the goat to catch the dog. She swallowed the dog to catch the cat. She swallowed the cat to catch the bird. She swallowed the bird to catch the spider. She swallowed the spider to catch the fly. I don't know why she swallowed that fly. She won't say why. There was an old lady who swallowed a cow. I don't know how she swallowed that cow. How did she do that? But swallowing the animals is not how this ends. Because she coughs so hard. Okay. Out flew all her new friends. They all came out. Thank goodness. There they are. The end. Yeah. How's the shaking coming along? Good. All right. Should we do a song? We haven't done this song in a long time. Let's. Do when I was a little fish. You ready? Let me see your little fish and the big fish. Little fish, big fish. Ready? When I was a little fish, little fish, little fish. When I was a little fish swimming in the water. My mama come to get me, get me, get me. My mama comes to get me and carries me home. Can you see it like this? Ha, ha, this the way. Ha, ha, that away. Ha, ha, this the way. And carry me home. Who else comes to get you from school besides mommy? Daddy, right? Hey, let's do daddy. Ready? When I was a little fish, little fish, little fish. Oh, when I was a little fish swimming in the water. My daddy comes to get me, get me, get me. My daddy comes to get me and carries me home. Let's see that away, ha, ha, this away, and carry me home. Who else comes to get you guys from school? Grandma coming. And what are we eating? Mm -mm. What did you and Elf make yesterday? Cheesecake. You made cheesecake. So excited for we're gonna go eat with Grandma and Grandpa. Yeah. Yeah, so exciting. That is another no. wonderful thing you can make for Shavuot. Cheesecake. I love cheesecake. So sometimes my grandma and grandpa come to pick you up. Let's do that. Okay, ready? When I was a little fish, little fish, little fish. When I was a little fish swimming in the water. Grandma and grandpa come to get me, get me, get me. Grandma and grandpa come to get me and carry me home. Ha, ha, this away, ha, ha, that away. Ha, ha, this away, carry me home. Oh, it's so much fun, friends. I'm so glad you guys are enjoying your ice cream. I can't wait to finish making mine. Thank you for coming today, guys. Let's sing a goodbye song, okay? Are you ready? Adi, 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 adios. Adi up behind, adi down below. 
out and in your ears, way down into your toes. Singing, adi, 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 goodbye. Bye, friends. Thank you for joining us today.